know, pineapple's already a crime on pizza, but they just really make it worse to put it on a freaking burger. Hey guys, welcome or welcome back to my channel. For those of you who are new, my name is Natalie. I have a special guest here today. I have Matthew. Hello. Woo! Now, um, you'll probably see some clips from when we were in Chapel Hill today. We stopped by Duck Donuts, and these things look delicious. Look, look at all these donuts. How cool is that? Oh, it ripped apart. Did it really? They must be good then. Wrong. This is a maple bacon donut. He no. had a glazed one, right? Yeah, it's really good. Is it? Ah, I can't eat it. Ah, it's on you. Yeah. Ah. <laughs> then that's in the box. But, um, I can't eat these because I am gluten free, but he's enjoying them for me. Our order was pretty. Maple bacon, two Oreo, two cinnamon bun, two powdered sugar, strawberry shortcake, and um, white liquid with sprinkles on it. Yes. Yes. Basically. But we're getting ready to head home. I also got stuff from Apple Hill. Let's see if it'll stay. Went to the student store while we were there. Got a cutesy little shirt for my nephew. Look how cute this is. I wish I could see the clothes. And I got That's myself me, a t-shirt. Yeah, it is for him, plot twist. And I got myself a little t-shirt. I have an obsession with t-shirts. You can literally ask Matthew over. Everyone else, I have purged my closet and I continue to buy t-shirts like it's nothing. So we're gonna go home, kind of chill out. This was gonna be a day vlog, but I was a little moody today and didn't do it during the day. She was moody from the beginning. So <laughs> we're gonna do a weekend vlog. So this will kind of go into like tonight and tomorrow. Good morning guys. It is currently Sunday, August 1st. It's crazy to me to think that it is officially August and that we're more than halfway throughout the year. We're in month eight out of 12, which is crazy to me. So, I mean, it's the last few months. It's time to grind it out and go for all the goals and things that we all want in life. But um, I'm on the way to church this morning. Matthew, we both drive separate because after this he goes back on base and I go back home and get my stuff together for the week but pretty much um I'm on the way to church we're gonna go to church after grab a quick lunch and then um I have to go get some thank you cards from Target get some cards from Target just in general and then I want to browse around at cameras at Best Buy just to kind of look at their Canon cameras we had fun yesterday in Chapel Hill. We got there right around like two, right about two, I want to say, I was to say 2.30ish. Um, we walked to the old well. I'll try to insert some pictures of all the stuff we walked to the old well. Um, kind of walked around campus a little bit more. Looked at the old library. Um, and it was humongous, the library on Chapel Hill. Matthew took quite a few pictures of me. Went to the student center because I really wanted to get a t-shirt. I'm a t-shirt lover. And if you've seen like the last few clips, you saw the shirt that I got. And I also got my nephew a t-shirt. Went to the planetarium after and that was so awesome just to see the North Carolina sky. Of course, I was asleep by the time I got home so I couldn't look at it in real life. But seeing it on that projection was pretty cool. And then after that, we went to Sub Dogs. Let me say, with IBS, for those of you that don't know, my stomach is very weird about things. I pretty much like spoiled myself with fries and cheesy tots and a burger with no bun. And I could feel it after, and then I could feel it at three this morning. So I don't understand how like people could booze out and eat that. Kudos to you for having a strong stomach, but not me. But the food was pretty good. I really liked it. It's definitely one of those game day foods that like, if I'm coming after a football game, I'd love to eat food there. But super fun day, but yes, on the way to church, gonna kinda try to vlog a little bit here and there today. So just stay with me. Say happy Sunday. Like a what did you say, frittata? I thought it was an omelet. Omelet frittata. Like, I'm like, what? <laughs> With bacon, cheese, um, sour cream, avocado, all of that. He's complimenting your car, babe. Oh, thanks, dude. <laughs> and 
and he had a chikichanga, which is like a tortilla with like eggs and all that good stuff in it. It was a burrito. A burrito, yeah, probably a burrito. burrito. It was a fancy burrito. I don't know why and it's burrito. some really good French toast that I couldn't eat. But we're gonna go to Best Buy. I wanna look at vlog cameras and we're gonna look at some gaming computers for him. Kinda wanna check out IMAX while I'm here. Not that I'm gonna get one. And then also gonna go to Target so I can go ahead and get my back to school stuff and a few other things. What if Target has? Because probably gonna ask for one for Christmas, but 159 on to Target. <laughs> currently just looking at home stuff we're kind of getting an idea of like what we get the feel for for homey things pots and pans are a must though so that's what we're looking at <laughs> crazy right now because I'm grabbing my things together for my what I got for school haul. I start back nursing school Monday so I've got a variety of things going on but I'm just gonna hop on here and show y'all what I have. This first thing I have is this pencil pouch and it's just a whole bunch of peaches super cute and inside I have the midliner highlighters I think they were like the 15 pack they're double sided alongside these tropical colored paper mate felt pens. I love these. They write so nice and neat. I use the black one for my Bible journaling a lot. This is really nice. It was three bucks from Target. Now on to some of the bigger things. Let's see for that thumbnail will go. Okay. I got a huge pack of printer paper. I have a wireless printer that I keep in the um, dining room slash work room. But my notes I'm planning on taking this year besides my PowerPoints are going to be on paper like this just to condense them and turn them into study guides. So I grabbed a big pack of this between this and printing off my PowerPoints. I have some sheet protectors. These are really good for important documents. I find that my most important documents get the most destroyed in a binder so this is very useful a pack of pencils because i feel like i always run out of pencils without a doubt i tend to write with pen more in school especially with notes but it's nice to have a pencil around whenever we're doing worksheets in class or i'm doing study guides and i need to like go back and add things or take things off My favorite color is blue, so without a doubt, I had to get a blue binder. This is the 3-inch Avery Heavy Duty Binder, and what I'll do is you go on their website, and you can print off a free um, template that's like Nursing 111, whichever class you're taking, Biology, Physiology, Chemistry, but a huge binder for my first year of nursing school because there's a lot of paperwork you get. A pack of Paper, ma paper Mate ballpoint pens there are 20 in here i love pens like this i like smooth writing pens i've never used these before i've used the gel pens so i'm hoping these work just as great as the sharpie gel pens love these for clinical paperwork and taking notes i have three packs of these dividers these are just tab dividers that you can put in your binder and i thought they were cute they're pink light blue navy blue green and lavender i have about 12 different subjects that we go through there's 15 in here so whatever's left over i can choose for the next semester the last thing i have is this one star notebook i like this for clinical or whenever we have dosage calculations whenever i need it because there are times where we're going over things and i like to have a notebook readily available for any and everything that i need 
that was all for my school supplies. So this video for Weekend in the Life kind of got cut short because I had so much going on. I still do this week between cleaning and everything. So if you see me in the same outfit in the next video, it's because I'm recording this all at the same time.